This video is not financial advice. I am not a financial planner. I'm an entertainer, baby. The one, the only, ape father in the house. Wow! You know, I'm trying to keep things positive. I'm trying to be a happy ape. But you apes drive me crazy. You drive me crazy. And ooh, ooh, looking at other plays. Oh, ooh, ooh. You should have common sense. You should have known by now. AMC is the say, yeah. AMC is the only play. That's all that should get your focus. That's all that you should get your attention, baby. All you should be doing is like, I don't want to keep being redundant and saying the same things over and over again, baby. But you need to go to Fidelity. Get out of Robin Hood. You know, I hear all these apes. I'm afraid the squeeze is coming. I can't hear it no more. Guys, you don't have to sell your Robin Hood shares. You don't have to sell your Weeble shares, your TD America, uh, uh, America shares. It's all simple. Okay, you're making me crazy. See, I can't even speak. That's how crazy you're making me. Next thing, people are going to say, what's your name? Richie. I'm going to be like, uh, you know, what's uh, Richie uh, is a uh, dick. I don't know if you know. You know Dick Clock? <laughs> I was on a cruise boat with my friend. You understand? We're partying. We're drinking. We're, we're doing shots. And, uh, you know, some guy, he's like, was this very highfalutin guy with his wife, you know? Uh, Hello, my name is Charles. We're on this uh, beautiful boat, uh, you know? He goes, what's your name? I'm like, Richard. He goes, Dick! <laughs> it drove me crazy my whole life that people called me that, okay? But anyway, the point is this. That's what you guys are making, are making the AFA. You're making me crazy. You know why? What are you guys doing all day today? You're talking about this friggin' uh, B, whatever it is, big, clove, support.com. It's the same old story, okay? It's a distraction. It's meant to get you out of AMC, and precisely that's what happened. You want to know? I'm going to say it like it is. I'm not blaming the hedge funds. I know everyone's oh, going to say hedge funds. No, I'm not blaming. I think a lot of this is apes. A lot of this is apes looking now because they're getting, uh, you know, they're getting exhausted. They're getting tired of the wait for the short squeeze and they're looking to make some more money. And they're selling their, I, I'm just saying, that's why I really think it's happening. And they're, because, you, know, you know, I know you're going to tell me, hey, father, it's not true. Fud, fud. It's not fun. It's all over the place. Look, look at almost like there's at least several AMC channels, YouTube channels that are talking about support.com, that are talking about Be Big, that are talking about Clover. OK, so don't give me this this BS that this is all figment of my imagination, baby. It's all a figment of my I'm just imagining all of this. OK, then you got, I, you know, look, Teddy Zane, he seems like a nice guy. You know, I just listening to his video. My heart goes out to him in a way. My, my heart goes out to him because, you know, he does get a lot of hate and I get a lot of hate. <laughs> Okay, so he, I know how he feels. Hate is not a good feeling because all we're trying to do is help you apes succeed. He's got his way. I got my way. And listen, it's just sometimes people don't don't agree. He may be a very nice guy, and I'm not taking that away from him, okay? You know, I heard his music. He's a good musician. I will give him that credit. I heard him play a version of Lights by Journey with a band, and he kicked, you know, butt baby. He was a very good musician. I think he's a guitar player. Okay, you know, with that long hair, you know, he looks like Slash, you know. <laughs> but putting that aside, I don't agree with the swing trading. Because, it, you know you know what's happening? It's a combination of all of these things. It's a combination of swing trading. It's a combination of, of uh, day trading. It's a combination with options. It's a combination of lunatics that actually short AMC. There's some lunatics out there that are doing this. It's a combination. It's like we're fighting within our community. We're divided. We're See, the A father got a lot of heat because you said I was divided the community in all in actual reality I was trying to bring us together okay I'm trying to get us all on the same message but you remind me of like a mouse you know not a mouse it's a rat is it a rat no it's a mouse you know those science projects they do yes yeah, mouses forgive me all right the mouse in the cage okay so a buddy of mine was a psychology major okay he's also a drummer a very good buddy of mine in Brooklyn Joey he used to tell me these stories, right? In his class, he had these mouses, right? So the point is to see if the mouse would continuously do the same thing, okay? Which which what they do is they put them in a cage. There's a little piece of cheese, right? And there's like this door. So they got to kind of put, they smell the cheese. The cheese is on the other side of this little door. But the thing is, when they put their little mouse nose on the door, <laughs> they electrocuted. Okay, so now you would think after maybe doing that one time, Two times, 
three, three times, four times, five, several times, right? The, the mouse would stop, right? No, it doesn't stop because it smells that damn cheese. It wants the cheese. It puts its nose to the door, right? It just keeps going for that freaking cheese. And the thing, the point of this experiment is that the mouse is never going to get the cheese. It's a trap. Don't you understand? It's a setup. It basically wants to see how many times this buffoon friggin' mouse will keep trying to get the cheese. There's no chance of it getting the cheese. It's going to just keep getting electrocuted. And that's what I think happens with apes. It's like you guys, you see Clover, you see support.com, you see this be big, whatever it is, you know, you smell the damn cheese, but the cheese is not real. You got to worry about the bananas. You understand? You got to worry about, hey, let me, let me get Ape Jr. here. Come on. Ape Jr. We got to talk to these apes. Come on, ape. Come on, listen. How do you feel about support.com? He's angry. How do you feel about Clover? How do you feel? Okay. What do you think about AMC? That's the high happy, you hear him? Listen, AMC, it's easy as one, two, three. Wah! One, two, three, AMC, buy for you, a buy for me. AMC, how easy is one, two, three. I buy for you, I hold for you, you buy for me, you hold for me. That's what we need to do, baby, but only on Fidelity. Buy AMC on Fidelity. Get out of Robin Hood, Weibo. TD Ameritrade, E-Trade, get out. You ever see like the Amityville Horror, the movie? You know, they all go in, they think they got a beautiful house, right? Whoa, we got the discount of a lifetime, baby. And all of a sudden, a voice says, get out. <laughs> you know that voice in the house? They freaking screaming, blood coming down to the walls. The house is shaking, crucifix falling. Get out. You know something, baby, that's something you need to listen to, okay? If I heard something like that, I'm running my ass off, right? So that's what I'm telling you for Robin Hood, for TD Ameritrade, E-Trade and Fidelity. Listen, ready? Get out. Go to Fidelity.